Hi, I purchased a uh, Mitutoyo of eBay uh, in broken, not working condition. And sometimes the the screen comes on like this. So I would like to try to attempt repairing it, and I will show you if I can repair uh, it. I will show you how you can do it. And in this particular one, if you want to open, you need to uh, take this piece off but one there's one problem is if you push it if you separate it too far then there's a flex cable inside I can just show you now I guess this is what happened with the previous owner perhaps the electronics has some problem and they wanted to check it but when they open it they tear the flex cable and that is the, the piece that goes to here and this is the piece that torn apart. I will fix the flex cable but I'm still not sure if the if the machine will will still work. And I'm expecting a electronic issue. First I'll remove the screw screw which holds the flex on the PCB then I will desolder the the flex from the PCB so it would work easy in, in an easy way and then I will scrape the first layer that protect the layer uh, on the flex to expose the, the copper. Some flex doesn't have copper, unfortunately you cannot solve anything on them, but these, these have copper uh, inside and kind of easy. And now I apply solder and be careful not to apply too much heat. It may delaminate and now I'm removing the, the, the flux residue to, to work uh, an easy way. It's a jumper wire, it's a coated very thin wire, uh, the best part of, about it is it <laughs> will not short circuit when it touches each other so you can really uh, work in tight areas. So you need to remove the coating to be able to solder on it. And if you have a thin, thin soldering iron, uh, it's very handy. And I'm checking for the continuity and the shorts with a multimeter. Now I'm soldering it back on the PCB and this tape is for to, to be able to remove if I need to without tearing the solder joints. That's the whole purpose of it. And then now I will make a one last test with the multimeter to see if everything is connected properly. And now I'm just putting the screw back which holds the flex cable and now I'm just putting back everything and then put in the battery that that screen is common with the mitutoyos when you first install the battery it's normal and as you can see it's working it's functional the repair was successful so if you have any recommendations or comments please leave it in the, the in the below section and if you want to help me please subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching